Good morning, beautiful souls. I'd like to come today and talk a little bit about energy and healings. And I'd like to talk about our gut feelings. Did you ever like have that gut feeling deep inside you, you feel it, and you just know, you know something's gonna take place. You know something is going to happen. Well, I wanna let you know it's in that place, that feeling, that gut feeling, that thought, that present moment, that it's in that place where we can manifest. That's where we manifest our lives. For those of you that don't know me, my name is Holly Capiello and I'm an intuitive Reiki master teacher. And I come forth with blogs and videos on how to tune in and tap in to universal energy to receive your greatest and your highest good. And I'd like to talk about a blog I wrote and it was about our gut feelings, that, that place of feeling, that place of knowing. When our thoughts are when we release our thoughts into this universal, infinite wisdom, our thoughts are in creation. The universe is made up of energy molecules, and we are energy spiritually, physically, and mentally. And within this universe, there's universal energy, and this energy interconnects all of us. It connects us to our surroundings and to each other. And it's in this infinite wisdom that I've learned to tune in and tap into where I learned how you can create and manifest your life. May it be good or bad, and it's all through thought. Our thoughts are energy, and they get released into this beautiful, infinite wisdom. And it gives back to us what we, we put out. So when we think of something, our thoughts are in creation. May it be good or bad. So how are you thinking? Like, are you thinking on a positive vibe or a negative vibe? And as you know, positive vibes are the highest vibrational energy, which is love, peace, enlightenment, joy, you know, success, all those fun things. And it's through the higher vibrational energies where you manifest for your highest good. But there's also fear, jealousy, hate, resentment. And that's a very, very low vibrational energy. And when you focus on that, all you're doing is creating more chaos within your life. So I'd like you to be more present like try to be more present with your thoughts and be cautious about how what you put out there are you waking up saying shit today really stinks because you know what your day is really gonna stink or are you thinking oh my god this is great it's a beautiful day it's sunny out the skies are blue and today i'm gonna receive my greatest good because guess what then you will then you will see your greatest good so I'd like to bring forth about how our energy works. Our energy has a vibration, just like when you throw a rock in the water and that it ripples out. We as human beings, we do the same. Our thoughts get released and they ripple out into this universal life force energy. And then it comes right back to us. So what we put out, we receive. It's like, it's like the law of karma. It's like a mirror image. And if you focus on, on something that you want to achieve, like a dream, a, a manifestation success, and you think it and you feel it, feelings are energies in, in motion, emotion. And we put it out there and the universe feels it and it brings it right back. It's just amazing the way it works. I have studied and practiced and I watched others and I just see, you know, I could see what vibration they're at. So also our vibration has a frequency and we attract the frequency we're on. That's how we get our group of friends, things in common, things that attract us because that's the frequency we're on. So if you're on a high vibration, you're gonna receive a lot good back. And if you're on a low vibration frequency, you're gonna receive the same back. You know, are you, are you stressing? Are you, you know, overwhelmed? Are you, you know feeling fear from just everything that's going on in the world you have to learn how to break away you have to learn how to work on yourself and do some self-care and raise your vibration because it's in your energetic vibration where we manifest it's where where things happen where things create our thoughts create our future outcome and if we are more aware and more in the moment and we're, we're present with what we're thinking and we practice thoughts of higher vibrations, thoughts of succeeding, 
thoughts of love, thoughts of joy, thoughts of enlightenment. Again, that's what you're going to receive. So take the time to really try to understand where you are energetically, vibrationally, what frequency you're on, because in return, that's what you're going to receive back from this universal life force. And again, this life force connects us. It interconnects all of us. It connects us to our surroundings and it connects us to the universe. And when you really learn how to tune in and tap into this infinite wisdom, you can work with it and you can create a life of peace, love, joy, success, whatever it is you're trying to achieve. So if you're having like a rough day and energetically, you're just not feeling it, again, that's an indication for some self-love, self-care, to take care of yourself and just start raising your vibration again because you want to keep your vibration higher. You want you want your vi vibrational energy to rise. And this way you attract what it is, what frequency you're on. So really like take time and really tune in and tap into your energy. Take the time to tune in and tap into this beautiful, infinite universal life force and work with it and see how you, you know, see how your life goes forward. You can change your life just through thought. You can change your life through feeling. And if you're looking to achieve your highest good, recognize your vibrational frequency that you're on. And if you're on a lower vibrational frequency, take the time out to do things that help raise your vibration so you will receive your greatest and highest good and overall well-being. So again, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like my video, like and subscribe. I'll be coming forth on Wednesdays with more videos uh, just to help you tune in and tap in to your energy, this universal life force energy, and you can receive your greatest and highest good. So keep up the good vibes, guys. I want to see you all succeed and receive your highest good always. All right, take care. Have a good day. Bye-bye.